hey guys so i made this vintage room in blender the lighting works best in cycle so let's switch into the cycle so this tutorial is about how you can make this type of room in blender and most of the models are from polyheaven.com check them out oh look at these fruits how good they are looking without wasting any time let's hop into blender so with blender open delete everything and add a basic human rig you need a rigify add-on for this which you can enable in edit preferences add-on and search for rigify we need a cube to make our room and delete the roof so we can see what's going inside uh, with based on our rig we will decide the height of the room and start blocking out the shape of your room a room has a height about 10 feet which is 3.04 meter so we are making it a little smaller because we will add a roof later there are some free resources on my gum road and some projects file you can play with and also the fruits i used in this scene so these fruits have uh, two types one with physics and one without physics you can delete the physics one or if you want you can change the container and you can use the basics one which you have to just duplicate in copy paste and have some details in your scene then i start adding space for the door as loops to make door shape i used archimesh iron for this door then i placed the door scaled it to match with the area we created Now add more details to the walls. I want a wooden covering across the walls in bottom. I separated the bottom so I can add vertical edge loops. Bevel the edges here so we get those nice detail in the bottom of this. Now some windows with again Archimesh add-on. I have added all the add-ons list I used in the description. So if you think uh, how I did that, check description. Solidify modifier for thickness. Uh, this worked weird in my case. So I separated the extruded part from the wall and joined it with the bottom wooden part. Then I added cells and the room looks quite large so I scaled it. We need a couch for resting. So add cube, start modeling the shape simple and easy. and after modeling basic shape i bevel all the edges to get that nice round edges we are shading one extrusion fix it for the legs of couch add a circle and make it nice cone shape little shifted to the left from bottom We are not using any character, this is just fun. One more shell here, little nice so I will model it quick and easy. solidify modifier for some thickness just check even so you don't get this weird extrusions add a nice cabinet for a tv this will be the main focus of our scene and add some details with bevels and extrusion having the corner details on the wooden things make it feel realistic
a cloth will make it look good add plain subdivide add cloth physics and make cabinet collision and that's it i modeled the tv by myself but later i replaced it with assets so you can see this if you want wanna add your own Having some reference for stuff you are doing is a great way so you don't bother yourself with imagination and modeling. Now texturing and lighting I used two light blue and orange because I want some more light For the walls I used single image from texture.com add new material assign it to the floor I want to make a wooden floor so let's find some wooden floor image for couch i also used a single image change its hue and darken it one more wood texture for this part let's texture the tv just basic brown color for the tv and for the screen i used wave texture with color ramp and to give more variations i added a mix rgb after the texture coordinate and used the noise texture to displace the wave a carpet image for the cabinet cloth let's add a roof so we can play with the lighting and area light to kind of mimic the screen lighting this is it for this video and there will be part 2 coming this sunday see you soon